from him, but he went slower doing that. He's got a decision to make. I think he's got, I think you're at Frisco, you've got to go back to the top over here and one and three and four. Having the nine to go, still so much time. Oh, I love the high entry for the eight. He'll put him down the hill, get the run, and he'll have the momentum of the 14. The fans are on their feet, lady. Nine laps to go here in Darlington. It's just Not only to win the Southern 500, but to win your way into the playoffs. Briscoe that Briscoe time to he's going to have a run. He's still pretty even. To pull the pass off on the 84. Ty Gibbs going to try to get out of the way. Classy North. Let these two figure it out. Looks like, right looks like Bush has used up his stuff now. Looking at the Bush cars. Bush tried to run up there with him. It did not work. Briscoe needs to stay to the top in three and four. And Bush needs to get back to the bottom. A week ago, Is this going to be the exact seven. history repeats itself for the Xfinity Series? That's what it's looking like. I'll get revenge for that here tonight. I like what the eight's doing in one and two. That higher exit is definitely working. It's like he's out of time. He's out of time. The 14 right on the wall, but he can't touch it. The 14 is not. This guy's not like Larson there. Even though he is doing really good right now. And he's still going to be able to do that. The disqualification of Austin Dillon with it at Richmond. The loss of the appeal. Then the loss last week, Kyle Bush. And Richard Childress has been on a roller. Imagine another loss again. Two weeks. It's not over till it's over, though. The eight goes to the top that time, coming to four to go. It was an advantage. Another car there, lap car. Get out of the way. Credit to Chase right Briscoe to handle this pressure. Not straight away. Straight away. Been yes. relentless. And Pretty it. much since the restart with the storming Kyle Bush. Oh, good run by Bush right here. Makes a little momentum on him. Three laps to go. And just under three tenths of a second between these two. We're still got it too low that time. Last push to make a little bit of gain on him. Been around with Bush for a long time. This sellout crowd has been treated to one heck of a finish, and it's not over yet. Oh, touch the wall once. Bush, I, but Bush also, Bush also lift off of it. Two laps to go. No gain. Three of these guys are pretty excited. I just have to go over and up hitting the ball. You know, Bush follows. These two were beating and banging on each other four years ago in the Xfinity Series race. It's going to happen again. And it was Briscoe who came out on top. Now look at Kyle Bush. Bush can't dig. His tires are too long. Briscoe hits the wall. That's going to help Kyle Bush there because he hit the wall. There is nothing between these two at the end of 500 miles. White flags. All right, Briscoe's better here. Briscoe's better here. It's gonna help Briscoe. It's gonna help Briscoe. He watched, they're, they're both wobbling. Their tires are used up. Kyle Bush will have to literally wreck them. It's too late. He can't get there. No, he's not gonna get there. Briscoe. That's it. Wow. <laughs> Once again, he had to race with his heart out, racing his hero again. Remember, Briscoe said he was racing his that? childhood hero. There's uh, only yeah. 10 races left from here on for the Stuart Haas Racing Corporation, and Chase Briscoe just raced his way into the playoffs. The 
that's how much it means right there. He's in 